Welcome back gamers, my name is Rolezy and right now it's time to talk about the only working money glitch, it is a solo money glitch, so like the video, comment, subscribe, and turn post notifications on. Now what you're going to need is to be in an invite only session, preferably free aim if you're on Xbox, MOC with the personal vehicle storage, a free LG inside the MOC, and a retro custom or a Benny's vehicle that you want to duplicate, no custom plates needed, and you want 10 piss washers as well. Now, as you can see right here on the screen, what we're doing is we're using the run method. Now, a lot of people are saying that this is patched. No, there was a recent hotfix put in today by Rockstar, but it's just the spamming Y when getting in and out of the caddy. That method is patched. You can't do that. I have already placed hotfix on the title of that video, so don't worry about that one. But this method, I have two methods in this video that are still working. And as you can see right here, I'm running towards it. I press Y and he's getting in there as I'm getting sucked in the MOC and I end up on the infinite black loading screen. The run method still works guys, so if you want I will put that link down in the description to check that video out. But right here I do have another method that is working as well. So this is how you want to start off the glitch. You want your MOC outside with your free elegy in the MOC and you want to go ahead and drive inside of your bunker. Now the reason we do this is so when we make the dupe, the dupe spawns over uh, outside of the bunker and then we can just basically it's really easy to rinse and repeat I'm gonna show you guys how to go you know that you want to be going to your CEO office you want to have the duplicate uh, the car that you want to duplicate inside of one of your CEO garages so that you can refill on beers so I'm gonna explain all of that uh, real quick though shout out to the founders ZoomX and Bruntango and right here as you can see we are driving inside of the bunker. Now, I'm going to end up getting out of my, you know, MOC right here, and I'm going to go grab one of the caddies. Now, we are using a caddy, but it's not the spam Y, you know, get off and back on real quick. That's, that is what's, what's hot fix. There is a two second delay, I believe, on the blue circle, and that's why we're not actually able to get back on while getting glitched out. So what you want to do is get your caddy. Remember, the free allergy is already inside the MOC. You want to go ahead and drive up like that. And I tried to do it like this, driving all the way up and actually hitting the MOC. Now go ahead and request a job from Simeon, Martin, or Gerald. It all will work. It's all the same, you know, type of thing. So request the job. And now what you're going to actually want to do is you're going to be starting the job while you're sitting in the caddy and it's going to, you know, shoot you up into the job. And then you're just going to simply back out. And the whole point is to start spamming Y right when you come back. So you see, I launched the job. My screen actually glitched out right here and it did some weird thing. It wasn't supposed to do that. It's supposed to actually put you in the lobby. So I ended up just doing it again, it was just a fluke. And I launched the job right here. So check it out. Now I'm in the setting screen. This is what you want to see. So go ahead and back out of it. And this is going to be a failed attempt right here. So I, I come back and you see, I was trying to spam wine. I was trying to get in there, but it didn't work. I got put inside of the MOC. That is not what you want. You want to be you want to see the animation of him trying to get onto the caddy. OK, so make sure when you come back, you just start spamming Y. Now, I found out that this actually is is it's really dependent on the placement of the caddy itself. So once again, I drove all the way back on. This was the old method where you open up your interaction menu and, and then, you, you know, you back out and you try to spam Y. That method is patched. It doesn't work. So I was able to get right back on here. I'm going to open up my phone and I'm going to start that Simeon job. Now I'm going to activate it. Once we get into the setting screen, I'm going to back out. And now I've backed out and I'm spamming Y, spamming Y, spamming Y. But look at this. I actually did it too quick. I moved around too much and it didn't work. But look, I kind of back up just a little bit. You know, once I once I touch that, I back up just a bit and it actually works this time. So the placement is really important. So start up the Simeon job or Martin or Gerald back out of it and check this out. It's in slow motion. So now you're going to see I spawn back. I'm spamming Y, spamming Y, spamming Y. And look at this, he starts actually getting back onto the caddy. Now I'm glitched out, I'm in the infinite loading screen, okay? So once you're in the infinite loading screen on Xbox, you're gonna wanna join a friend in a different targeting mode. That's why I said to be in free aim. Usually people are in assisted aim, you're gonna accept the first alert, decline the second. If you're on PlayStation, you can actually start up a recent activity and then decline it. And the whole point is to now get glitched into this area right here, okay? So now once we're glitched in here, you're gonna go ahead and drink. Remember, double tap A, and then hold on the second tap or X on PlayStation. And when you double tap, he's going to drink the entire beer. You got a few indications that he's done with the beer. Five to six swigs. Usually he's done and he drops it and you can hear it and you can start pressing it again. Or if you look at the bottom right hand side of the screen, when he drops it, uh, the little option to use comes up. So you see that right there, a little a, a button to use. That's what you want to see. And then you can start drinking the rest and about two swigs into the eighth beer. 
is when you basically start passing out. Now, I was a, you can either go up to the hospital, this is where it's a little bit different than my old videos, you can go up, to, you know, up the ladder to the hospital and you can grab a helicopter from there, or if you're a CEO, you can just spawn your buzzard yourself, you know, and get it right on the street, and you can actually just, you know, hop in the buzzard and go ahead and fly away. But as you can see right here, the hospital on the right hand side, there actually are, you know, there's usually a helicopter that does spawn up there, so you can very well go up to the hospital and, you know, yeah, right there on that helipad, you can go up there and you can actually grab that helicopter that's sitting over there. So either way, it'll work. Now, usually I was going to my garage on in or in Integrity Way, and I was picking up the car that I wanted to dupe there. But this time, I'm going to show you an easier way to rinse and repeat. You're going to just end up going to your CEO office. So like I said in the beginning of the video, make sure that you have the car you want to duplicate in your CEO office garage. And you're going to go ahead and just land normally like you, like you would. And, you know, don't be alarmed when you see yourself actually, you know, visible because you're still in the glitch. You're still invisible. It's just a little bit trickier um, or it's not even trickier. It's just, you know, some more precautions to take just so that you can actually keep rinsing and repeating. So I'm just going to go up to my assistant right here, request to have some snacks, go to Pisswiser, and there you go. So I can just end up restocking. You're going to go back invisible, just like I said. You know, don't worry about it if you're visible real quick. So now I'm going to go to my office garage too because that's where that's where I have my retro elegy that we're going to be duplicating. Remember, you can duplicate any Benny's vehicle. I only recommend Benny's vehicles. And of course, I highly recommend the Retro Custom. You will get close to a million dollars if you fully upgrade that thing every single time. And you'll never get that can't sell for, you know, for more than $50,000, you know, message. That's only when you duplicate other cars other than Benny's vehicles. So I wanted to get one of these cars that has a custom plate on it so that I can actually show you guys that the uh, the plate from the free LG I had inside my MOC does indeed transfer over to the uh to this car you know that i'm duplicating so here we go i have my custom plate right there as you guys can see now just remember that that's a custom plate now we're going to end up just tapping right trigger or r2 on playstation open up your interaction menu go to mobile operation center and request it now once we request it this is where the car actually dupes we end up spawning outside of our bunker you know why we're outside of our bunker that's because we started the glitch out with the moc outside the bunker okay that's why i said to start it and there you go 83 nap 813 now request the moc once again this is the duplicate right here this isn't some change plate glitch no this is a duplicate a complete brand new car that just duplicated all right so you're just going to request your moc one more time and once it spawns just head over there and as you're making your way over there, all right, and now since we have gotten there, you're just gonna simply press right D-pad to go inside, and we're gonna get that glitchy cutscene where you're back inside the bunker. Now, that's exactly what you wanna see. Sometimes if you're not on a flat surface, you won't see that. It's okay, the glitch still worked. As long as you got the duplicate, you're good. And there you go, the duplicate is saved, but you know me, I like to double save it just in case. You never know, I've had people lose cars because they only drove it in once and they didn't drive it in again. But what you can do right here simply, you know, this is the uh, the other part to rinse and repeat. You remember how we started in the beginning of the video, just sitting outside here in the uh, outside of the bunker? This is why I was sitting out there. I had just gotten finished duplicating a car. So I'm just going to return vehicle to storage through my MOC right there, and I'm going to call my mechanic now. And remember that free black elegy that I had inside the CEO garage when we first walked in there? I'm going to go ahead and request that, you know, LG RH8 from the CEO garage office, uh, office garage 2. So once I request that, it's going to end up spawning on the street and we're just going to simply end up driving this right into the MOC and it's going to ask us to transfer cars. Now what it's going to do is it's going to transfer the uh, the retro elegy, the duplicate that I have inside of my MOC. It's going to transfer that car over to where this RH8 came from. That's exactly what we want because we want to keep doing this over and over again without having to change sessions. So check it out. You know, personal vehicle storage full. It's going to ask me to transfer. I'm going to say, yeah, definitely. So now we have our free elegy parked in here. We have the duplicate back in the garage and we're ready to do the glitch again. The MOC is outside. The elegy is inside the MOC. And just like you saw in the beginning of the video, you're just going to simply get in the MOC and drive it back in and go ahead and proceed with the dupe. And you can do this over and over again. Now, just in case they put a hot fix or another patch in today, I would definitely recommend leaving your console on if it stays, you know, unpatched throughout the day today. And if you really need money, I would, I would honestly keep it on until probably late tomorrow because who knows, they probably will patch it up tomorrow. 
Once again, if you have any questions, make sure to put them down in the comments. Guys, make sure to watch the entire video usually because I see some people asking questions that are clearly in the video. I love answering them, but I want you guys to be educated as well. And, you know, you guys would know the answers on some of these questions if you watch the entire video. But, you know, go ahead. If you're still unsure, write it in the comments. I have no problem answering you guys. So that's going to be it for me. My name is Roll Easy. Make sure if you enjoyed this video to hit that like button by, you know, giving it a blue thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe if you're new here by pressing that red subscribe button and turn on post notifications so you can be notified the instant I come out with any more fresh and informative dope GTA 5 online content. I'm Roll Easy and I'm out of here, guys. Take it easy.